Nathan was a prophet in Israel at the time of King David. One day, Nathan told the king a story about a rich man with many sheep and cattle who stole a sheep from a poor man. King David was incensed and declared that the rich man should make restitution and be punished. You are that man, said Nathan to the king. King David had stolen Bathsheba, the wife of Uriah the Hittite. He sent Uriah to the front line of battle, knowing that he would be killed there so that he could take Bathsheba as his own. Nathan denounced the king for this crime against both Uriah and God and declared God's judgment. King David knew that Nathan spoke the truth and repented of the terrible sin he had committed. Like other prophets who would follow, Nathan was not appointed by the king and he was not a member of the king's court. He was called by God to direct the king and the people to remain faithful to the covenant. Kings needed prophets. Kings could abuse their power for their own benefit. Out of fear or ambition, they could form questionable alliances and make compromises to the good and holy life to which God had called them. They could seek the favor and support of the rich and powerful and fail to attend to the poor and the needy. Kings needed prophets who would speak the truth clearly and would tell them when they had gone astray. Powerful leaders needed prophets 3,000 years ago. Powerful leaders need prophets today. King David did not always appreciate the criticism and direction he received from the prophet Nathan. Even so, Nathan was fearless and faithful in carrying out his responsibilities. We honor him for that.